Welcome to another video on convertible debentures. In this video, we will understand the term conversion value of convertible debentures. So the conversion value is simply the money worth of the convertible debenture if it is converted into shares right now. So at any point in time, if the convertible debenture were to be converted into shares, how much would be the value? That is known as the conversion value. So conversion value is equal to conversion ratio. That means how many shares are going to be received for each debenture multiplied by the market price per share of the equity. Equity means the shares. So basically what this means is let's say you are on a time scale of one, two, correction, remove this whole uh, line that I was saying. So basically what this means is let's say this is a time scale. 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. Let's say the redemption time of the convertible debenture is at the end of 4 years. That is at the end of 4 years you will get let's say 5 shares per debenture. So for each debenture you are going to get 5 shares. Now whatever is the market price of the share at the end of four years will be basically your worth of these five shares. So let's say you invested 100 rupees for one debenture. At the end of four years, these 100 rupees will going to become five shares. Now if each share at the time of conversion is let's say rupees 25 each so then at the end of four years your conversion value is 5 into 25 which is equal to rupees 125 but the conversion value is not just restricted to the value at the end of the tenure let's say at the point where you have spent 1.5 years with the debenture, let's say the share price is rupees 21. So at that point, the conversion value will be equal to 5 into 21, which is equal to 5105 rupees. So this is the conversion value. In the other videos also, I am going to cover uh, some more examples on these terminologies which will help clarify the fundamentals.